We're here in Big Bend National Park. We do everything big in Texas. Guys, this is huge. Did you even know that these mountains exist here? Not only that, we're gonna be talking about the best three reasons why you need to be here and come on this trail. As always, like, subscribe, and let's get straight into the video, guys. Hey there, welcome to Staying Fearless with your host, Joseph McMahon, where we have courage, take risks, and tackle our fears head on. Now we grow most in life when we get out of our comfort zone, and that's what this channel is all about. So like, comment, subscribe, and as always, stay fearless. So reason number one, not only is it beautiful, not only is it nice, not only do you have the deserts, mountains, and rivers out here, but it is only freaking $30 to get in. $30? $30 That's a steal. Seven days, man. Now, if you want to take a trip out here, you want to come in your RV, your van, you want to go into Lingua, Texas, which is the ghost town of Texas, which is like freaking gorgeous. That is going to be the closest town near here. Number two, did you know that we have one of the biggest bird species in the world? How peaceful is it whenever you go to your backyard, you sit on the patio, you hear the wind blowing, the water flowing, and the birds chirping. Chirp, baby. chirp, now, chirp, chirp. Now, we'll shut up for a little bit. And y'all just uh, enjoy this music and the scenery. We'll talk again here soon. Oh yeah, cowboy, back at it again with another video. Thank you guys for tuning in for another one. Now, Big Ben is one for the books. I absolutely love this freaking place. True, I think that this is what it's all about. It's just enjoying nature, enjoying the cactus, the every single living thing that's possibly out here. It's like, how the heck can things survive in the desert? But this is their climate. And uh, yeah, man, there's hundreds and what feels like hundreds and millions of freaking rocks check this out like so much time and energy goes into making these trails it's amazing but uh yeah you can get lost it feels like uh you're the only person out here um i mean just look around i do think it's i, I do think it is kind of dangerous uh even if you're in the best shape even if you're not in the best shape and and i think that a lot of people always say the dangers and the bad aspects of all this like oh yeah you're the only person out here what about if you roll your ankle what about if if you're in if you get in trouble you know what i'm saying and who's going to help you and how are you going to get back to the truck and but it's like why do we never question stuff whenever people are, are on these cranes and they're making these huge buildings near you above you or no one ever questions whenever you're going against traffic, right? And you see the double lines on the road. Why are you not questioning getting hit by somebody? And it's like, everybody wants to be so normal. And I get it. But whenever you start getting out the norm and you start doing stuff like this, then you also start getting those responses. Oh my gosh, I've always wanted to do that. Um, how do I get into this? How do I start? How do I get into hiking? Uh, how do I go on these trips? And it's like, bro, you just kind of, you gotta have to, you just gotta do it. Wait, 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 wait a minute, guys. I need your help, man. We're trying to get to 1,000 subs. So any like, comment, or share, I don't even, I don't even care if you just put a fire emoji or just say, I wanna go there. Let me know down in the comments, what is the trail that you've been on? What trail do you wanna go to? And I promise you, I'll get back to you because I probably have done it too. And we're trying to freaking grow this channel, baby. Oh yeah, on the road to 1K. Appreciate it. It really, really helps the channel, man. Thank you so much. Now, we'll get back to the video. All right, Fearless fam. Now, I have some sad news. I'm gonna be honest with you. So I really, really, really wanted to show you guys how beautiful it is whenever the water is here. I'm currently in a riverbed here. And uh, sadly, truthfully, it doesn't look like water's been here for at least a couple months, man. So we're not at the end of the trail, but so far every single riverbed where water would be is completely gone. It's completely dried up. I think that we're gonna have any water today. But yeah, man, Big Bend National Park. This is one of my, this is the best park in Texas. Said you have the bears, you have the mountain lions, you have the bobcats, you have the deserts, you have the mountains. You have everything here. I've even seen people canoeing, even whenever the temperature is, or the water is pretty low. I hope that we showed a lot of informational stuff today. 
and I have videos for every single tro here. Go ahead and like, subscribe. Please let us know what you want to see next time. I'm Josh McMahon. I'll see you on the next one, and y'all know how we end the videos, guys. As always, stay good. Out, baby. Thank you so much for sticking to the end of the video. You're really gonna like this video up next. But before I go, y'all know what we say, baby. Like, subscribe, and as always, stay fearless. We're out.